Hey guys, Jonathan here from TechMajesty.com. Today I'll be showing you how to instantly remove the Google FRP lock on your Samsung S7 and S7 Edge. This method will also work on all other Samsung phone models as well. So as you can see the phone is FRP lock and is asking for the Google account associated with the phone. To remove the FRP lock you will need a Windows computer and a USB cable. Now that we have all that ready, let's begin. So now we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will go ahead and order the FRP removal service. Alright, so now you will write the make and model of your phone. I have the Samsung S7, so that's what I'll be writing here. After that, you will click on the add to cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you'll receive an email within one hour informing you that we are ready to begin the unlocking process for your phone. The email will look like this and say order and closed. The email will contain a download link to the USB redirector, which is basically a software our technicians will use to access your phone and complete the unlock. Our technician will be on a live chat with you during the entire unlock process. The whole process will only take about 5 to 10 minutes for our technicians to finish unlocking your phone. All you have to do is plug in your phone to the computer and we take care of the rest. Now I'll show you step by step how the process will work. So this is the USB redirector software I was talking about earlier. The first step will be where our technician will ask you to plug in your phone to the computer using the USB cable. Then step 2 and 3 will involve the technician working on your phone's unlock. Then the final and fourth step will be the FRP Google account being permanently and completely removed from the phone. Now you can use the phone as you normally would. I've done all the prep work beforehand to make the video as short as possible. So now I will do the final part of the process to remove the FRP lock and once I do this then you'll see the FRP lock will be instantly removed. So just give me a second here. As you can see, the FRP lock was instantly removed. So guys, it's as simple as that to remove the FRP lock on your Samsung phone. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if this video helped you.